it's been a long time since I did make a video. I apologize for that because I was out of town. So now let's flash the Nexus Experience ROM on Redmi Note 3 and let's see how is it. So without further ado, let's make it happen. This is the official website of Nexus Experience ROM. You can download the ROM but do not download the firmware from here. Why? Well, continue watching the video and you will get to know that. Just a reminder to flash this ROM, you need to have an officially unlocked bootloader and TWRP recovery installed. As you can see, I am on the latest Rhino Joyce right now. And for those wondering, this wallpaper is a OnePlus 5 stock wallpaper. So now, switch off the phone and hold the volume up and the power button together to boot into TWRP recovery. Once you are booted into TWRP recovery, go to wipe, select advanced wipe, check cache, Dalvik cache, system and data. Now swipe to wipe. Once done, go back, go back, go to install, locate the ROM file. We don't need any separate GApps package here because it's included inside this ROM itself. Now swipe to confirm flash. And BAM I faced the error 7 issue even while being on the latest firmware. Well now I will tell you the right process to flash this ROM. Go to this XDS head linked below in the description of this video. You can download the ROM file from here too. It's actually the same file as the official ROM file. And you need to flash this firmware from this XDA thread. Actually it's a firmware by the Strix and it's supposed not to relock your bootloader if you have earlier unlocked the bootloader officially. Now let's start it fresh after downloading the ROM file and the firmware. Go to install, select the firmware file first then swipe to confirm flash. Now go back and install the ROM file. Everything should go fine now. Once done, hit reboot system and wait for the time being. Now as we are booted into the ROM, let me quickly set this one up. As far as features go, this ROM is very close to stock Android and it meant to give you the flavor of Google Pixel. These are the preloaded apps this ROM comes with. I mean rounded icons, blue colored text in the settings and all over the UI. Double tap to wake and sleep both are here. Multi window. Read mode is named as night light here. App action shortcuts and swipe left to right on the home screen to get Google feed. And of course, Google Assistant is there too. Camera is working fine, Vaulty is working fine. Pretty much everything works great. Even the battery life is pretty good too. I am really loving this pure stock android experience. Let me know in the comments below how do you feel about it and if you have any questions related to this ROM. So that's pretty much it for this video guys. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat. If this video helped you out, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you appreciate my work. It's totally free. And don't forget to click the bell icon next to the subscribe button because when each upcoming video goes live, you will get notified instantly. That's been it. Thank you for watching. This is Tito from Carry and Tech signing off. You guys have a great day. Bye bye now.